Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back. Hope you all are ready to continue The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day today. And let's get started, hey SQ. You're here, yatta! Yatta, the Adamsu. Uh SQ I How much cash do I have? Only 140. <clears throat> I did nothing. These past few days, I swear I heard a voice every time I walked past the restroom at night. Who in the world is it in there? I just wish they piped down. Hey, I just checked the Gru's uh, room and the guy's gone. You got any idea where he went? He had to run away because of his broken heart. What a tough guy. <laughs> it's the wrong room. Let's go do the ghost hand side quest while we're at it. <laughs> Sleep until midnight. <clears throat> SQ, what have you been up to today? Hey, oh, somebody, you? please, somebody help me. Hey, Bubbo. How are you doing today? Paper, please, somebody bring me paper. Bring me some paper. Any kind of paper at all. Okay, paper. Yeah, wrong room. Who's Fledge? I'll look at the guy trying to push ups. Five, six, seven. He's doing a better job than I am. You, just let me catch my breath. Oh, Link. What am I doing? I'm training. Can't even lift a single barrel. Pathetic, I know. That's why I want to get stronger. A bit embarrassed about it, though, so I do it at night when no one's around to laugh at me. But it's not going so well. I'm just too tired. I was actually about to ready to about ready to throw in the towel. Uh, if only there was a potion that would give me stamina, then I could drink that and maybe find that last little bit of strength I need. Fat chance, right? I suppose I'll have to just put up, uh, just put my nose to the grindstone. Yep, just buckle down my bootstraps and all, right? Oh, we can actually fix that as well. Okay. Lots of reading today and tonight. I'm gonna watch Dune. Dune! Sounds nice, dude. Oh. It's you, Link. What do you want with me? Huh? What am I doing? Bugs. I'm looking at bugs. Bugs. Bugs are amazing. Even more amazing than Groose in a lot of ways. Oh. I'm not saying Gruus isn't as amazing as a bug. Oh, Neo, Neo, Neo. I got some trophies. Nice, SQ. What have you been reading, by the way, Bobo? <clears throat> Collect all kinds of bugs. Sometimes I even dream about having, like, an entire island full of bugs. Ooh. How about this? Link, here's the plan. If you find a bug, come sell it to me. When it comes to rupees, or no... 
Okay. Won't just buy any book though. What I buy on given day just depends on the mood I'm in. Oh, and the other thing, this might bug you a little bit, but I only want to do these deals at night. I have a reputation protection now. Got link? Okay. Ferrum, Grasshopper, Sky of Mantis, and Lania Narus, and the Doom Roleplay core book. Nice. He wants to sell just one. <laughs> I don't want to sell anything at all to him yet. I never believe what happened yesterday. Something that never happened before in Bloodborne to me. Oh. Tell me more, tell me more. <laughs> Not afraid of Carusa's room is mine now. Well, really? Wow, Bruce has a big fucking room, by the way. The dickhead with the rattling gun on the first try. Nice. Good job, my dude. Good job. Knocked him off the roof, nice. Hmm, should I give it to her? Should I not give it to her? Wow, oh, Link, it's you. Don't sneak up on me like that. I have a serious dilemma on my mind right now, and you're distracting me. Can I help? Huh? Really? Normally I would never ask someone like you for help, but these are dire times. Come to think of it, you might be just the person I need. You seem to be pretty good at with ladies. Can't believe I just said that, but whatever. Let's do this. Link, I have a task for you. So listen up. Your mission is to take this piece of paper to a certain person. It's a very important piece of paper. Make sure you deliver it. Hmm. What's your problem? Why are you looking at the restroom? Beast kicked my ass uh, a few times, though. Didn't want to cheese it. I've never cheesed the Blood Starved Beast, actually. I didn't realize you could do that, or how to do it, actually. But Blood Starved Beast is definitely a bitch. <clears throat> There's someone in the restroom at night who wants paper. You fool! How dare you! This is no ordinary piece of paper. It's a letter, a very special one at that. I put my heart into every word. I guess you could say it's sort of like a... All right, fine. It's a love letter. And that is why you will not, under any circumstances, ever allow it to be used as toilet paper. Do you hear me? No. I, I think I need to use this letter as toilet paper. So listen up. The person you must give it to is a girl. A senior student. Her name is Karane. You know who I mean, right? She's the one with the round hats. She's really cute. You know the one. And don't you dare, not even by mistake, even think of giving it to the weirdo in the restroom. Swear it. Here. It is. I'm trusting this letter to you, so don't read what's inside. Do you hear me? Can you believe this letter might actually contain heartfelt words from Calvin? Take extra care that you don't end up using it as scrap paper. I'm counting on you, Link. Get to it. If you don't mess this up, maybe I'll let you be my sidekick. I want to be your little tiny fat-ass sidekick? No, I don't think so. Ah. Good to know, good to know. Olin, 
Karane, is she in her room? Hello, Karane son. She's not there. Let's go buy an energy drink for our, uh, our boy. <laughs> la da na 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 uh which one was the energy i think green is the energy right stamina Okay. Now let's think, am I gonna be a nice person? Or am I gonna give it to the... <clears throat> the toilet ghost? Can I give it to the toilet ghost after giving it to Karane? Let's see what happens. Aha, I go into the bathroom. Hmm, nice. As instructor Olan. Hello, instructor. Ah, Link, how's your search for Zelda going? Sorry for leaving it all up to you. I know you must be doing everything you can to find her. Question, if you have constipation and drink energy drink, all the energy helps you poop? No. <laughs> That's not how it works. <laughs> can I sleep in her bed? Ha! I can! I think it uh, only gives you more constipation. Unless there's laxative in it. You think you're doing in a girl's room at this time of night? You need to take a bath, so get out of here, Link. Well, I mean, I would take a bath if whoever's in there would hurry up and get out. You need to talk to me? Just come find me some time during the day, but I'm too lazy to find where the fuck you are on this giant ass island. Okay, you know what? I don't care. I'm giving it to the... I'm giving it to the ghost. Hey, I didn't even know this was here. Yay, we got another gratitude crystal. Yatta. We're giving it to the ghost. Sorry, I'm not an alpha male that would help a brother in need. At least, not in this game. Oh man. Ah, uh, paper, you brought me some paper? I'll open the door, please come in. Go sand. <laughs> oh, paper. I need paper. I'm not angry or anything. I just need some paper. You're giving me paper? I'm so happy. But this looks like someone's letter. Are you sure you're going to... Can I can have this? Yes. Fuck is Ensign. I quote whoever I want. Ansem is the guy you quoted. Oh my god, not again. Fini. May we meet again, you kind soul. Uh, I'm not that kind.
what I do find is very funny. Fledge needed a, a stamina in that potion. Stamina in that potion. Can feel my muscles perking back up again. It's just that at this rate, I don't know if I'll ever get strong and burly. Try your best! Right, that's exactly what I need to do. No more whining. Time to push myself. Without mustards. <laughs> The entire idea of a ketchup mustard cheese smoothie sounds absolutely disgusting. <laughs> and then it's it's just a <laughs> ketchup and cheese smoothie. Hey. Link, did you hand over the letter? Huh. Actually. Did you just say you gave it to the weirdo in the restroom? Didn't I specifically tell you not to give it to the weirdo in the restroom? Seriously, I said it like five times. I know I did. You fool, how could you? Anyone who blocks the path of true love deserves to be kicked by a bird. I hate you, Link. No, that's even worse. <laughs> uh, you fucking deserve that, you prick. I'm such a dick, but that guy is such a prick. I wasn't going to find where that girl was anyways. Not in the mood for that shit. So we're just giving it to the poor ghost lady. Who is now most likely in love with you. For the rest of eternity. Mm, help. Ah, you're the one from the other day. It's good to see you again, actually. Thanks to you, I met my true love. Yes, him. It all started with that letter that you gave me. Those beautiful words of affection. Caused me to fall hopelessly in love. Ah, my heart is bursting with thoughts of him. I feel so excited, so cheerful, so full of life. Yet you're dead. <laughs> you once said a smoothie. Well, several smoothies in my life. Smoothies. Smoothies. I'm pretty sure I need to get Fletch another stamina potion. Six, seven, still not done. My best is someday I'll be strong. Come back to me. And I'll show you the new you. Dirt long. I know, right? <laughs> such a savage. Such a dick. That guy is such a prick. Yeah! It did rhyme. Headmaster Rune. Can't be a dick SQ, not unless you do some surgery. Wait. Women can be dicks without having dicks. 
You're back, Link. Good to see you're still in one piece. So how's it going down there? Are you any close to finding Zelda? Hmm. I see, my dear Zelda. Things must be terribly... Things must be terribly trying for her down there. And I can't be easy for you now either, can it? What? You want to know the lyrics of the song Zelda sang on the day of the wing ceremony? You know I'm not much of a singer. Just lyrics. Just want the lyrics? Oh, what a relief. You really put me on the spot there for a moment. I believe the lyrics go something like this. O oh, youth guided by the servant of the goddess, unite earth and sky and bring light to the land. They are called cunts, Yordi. But I can call man cunts as well. Like. O oh, youth, show the two whirling sails the way to the light tower, and before you a path shall open, heavenly song you shall hear. I believe that's the whole thing. The light tower mentioned in the song is a real place. I'm sure you've seen the tower in the plaza. I don't know a thing about two whirling sails, though. It's like the song is suggesting... Wait, did my phone turn itself off? They didn't have an update. Okay. But how do you go doing that? And what does it mean two whirling sails? Hmm? Okay, I know two whirling sails. Who said you weren't? <laughs> Such a dick move, Yordi. <laughs> All according to plan. Why did my phone turn itself off? Almost, Bobo, almost. Thank you so much for tracking down Kukio Link. It's such a gorgeous day today, too. On a day like today, there's nothing I'd love more than to head over to the Lumpy Pumpkin for a sip of soup. But of course, my wife asked me to fix the cupboard, so I'm not going anywhere. There's a story of my life. Hey! What's up, Link? And before you find that grill now. Before you find that girl now. What girl? You're curious about the windmill, eh? Pretty smart design, I gotta say. See, you can turn the windmill so that it can always catch the wind no matter which way it blows. But, well, there used to be a little propeller attached to the windmill so that you could turn it. The thing flew off ages ago. It must have dropped off the edge down beneath the clouds. I actually know where it is. Windmill's been uselessly sitting there ever since. I highly suggest you retrieve the windmill propeller from the land below to reorient the windmill. You can find and thus forgave something to a ghost. Oh yeah, that girl. Yeah, I knew where she was during the night, but then she was complaining that she needed to take a bath and that I shouldn't talk to her in her room during the night. And I'm like, Lady, come on, I just need to give you something. 
<laughs> so I had to find her during the day and I couldn't be arsed. I want to know if I could fix the windmill if I brought back the propeller. Well, if I had the propeller, I could probably rig something to get her to get back on there, sure. Cakey, but how would you even go looking for a propeller in the first place? When something falls through the clouds, it's gone for good. Hang on, come to think of it, Gondo at the scrap shop told me that something in his family once used of a flying robot to haul junk back from beneath the clouds. Talking about a tale that's been passed down over a lot of years, so I couldn't put much stock in it. Okay. No, I stopped eating apples because I didn't want to eat apples anymore. Hey. hey, kid, what's up? You look like you need to get something off your chest. I think I know what it is. You've got to ask favor of me, right? Yeah. Huh? It's about the old robot my grandpa used to think around with. He probably just came here to make fun of the crazy junk guy for believing in his grandpa's stupid stories, right? Well, I'll get in line. I heard before. Wait, that's not why you're here? You say you need to pick up something from below the clouds with this robot? Do you know what that means? That means you believe in my grandpa's stories too, don't you? Well, I'm happy to hear that someone else believes me, but I don't think I can help you. You see, my grandpa's old robot... What's it called again? Oh, hey, that's right, I remember. His name is Scrapper. He may be... He may not be much to look at these days, but he was an amazing robot once. Uh, when you called him, he would go anywhere and haul anything. Sadly, as you can see, he's just another bustle hunk of junk. Time to experiment on a new fruit, maybe. If I felt like it. But old grandpa did tell me this. You can get him working again with the extract from an ancient flower. It's like oil to this guy. I've never even heard of it, much less seen any such thing. Take mine. What? You have one? Are you kidding me? That's amazing! That's amazing! So this is an ancient flower. I can feel some silky oil stuff coming out of its stem. Stem. Great, with this we can fix Trapper. Wait, right here. I'll have him up and run in no time. There you go. Do, 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 do. Thank you. Bzzzt. I've got a full tank of energy and I am ready to carry anything. Bzzzt. Huh? Who's these green clad individual of small stature? Whoa, talk! Can you believe that? I guess I really did fix him. This kid gave me the materials I need to fix you. Go on, say thank you. Hmm, are you sure it was him? Well then, I extend my reluctant thanks to you in gesture of obligatory gratitude. Hey now, watch it. That's no way to talk to someone who just saved your life. Anyway, this kid wants you to haul some stuff around and you're going to help him. Hmm, this individual may have restored my operations, but I am not inclined to offer assistance. Serving children is very low in my task priority. Master Link, materials from the windmill have yielded the signal that you may search for with your dowsing ability. Use it to locate the fallen propeller. However, it will not be possible to carry the item in your pouch and return to the sky. Who are you? Your name is Fee? Should I call you Mistress Fee? Are you looking for something, Mistress Fee? I... I understand. At your request, I will carry anything regardless of weight or destination. 
Master, we now have the means to bring the propeller back to Skyloft. You may immediately begin your search for the windmill propeller. Master Shortpants, I offer assistance. I can now detect Mr. Sfee's top waves. Should you need me, ask Mr. Sfee to call me and I will arrive with haste. So how do you plan to recover all that stuff that fell beneath clouds? You know, you could always ask the fortune teller over there. I know he's kind of goofy looking, but when it comes to finding things, he's always right on the money. I don't think I actually need to, because if I remember correctly, it's somewhere in the volcano. Da 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 na 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 na. I need to shave again. Temple entrance, yes. My beard is itchy. Feels a bit stitchy. Catch the bug. Ah, oh, crap, I stepped on it. I killed it! No! Out here. Pretty sure there were some. Butterflies up here the last time I was here. Nope. Maybe I imagined it. Wouldn't be too surprising. Oh, it's up there. I was about to say, I imagine a lot of things. The boing! Domo arigato, Mr. Robato. Give me them rupees. See, I had already found the propeller. This is the windmill propeller you were searching for. It is now possible to retrieve this using the robot whose services we have enlisted. Would you like me to call your robot? The robot, not your robot. I will send word to the robot using telepathic transmission, Master. Look at how fast this mofo is like. Yes, mistress! Please step on me! Mr. Sfee, I hope you weren't waiting long. So you want me to carry this? Hey, Master Short Pants, you're in my way here. Say, get out of the way! I'll be waiting for you up in the sky, so don't take too long. Master, I suggest that we also return to the sky and collect the propeller as soon as possible. Uh, how do we get back up there again?
Um, apparently, I can just run this. Good. Oh. Meh. What's up, Bubbo? Why are you meh -me -me in? Because of the weak S for Terra Chain? For all Terra Chain? <sighs> You're already sleepy. I gotta go have a good one, Bobo. You have a fantastic rest of your evening, my friend. And, uh... Talk to you soon. Here's that windmill propeller. If you need me, feel free to call. Mr. Sphia will travel to any destination. He's such a simp. That robot is such a simp! <laughs> oh wait, Twitch, are you gonna hate on me now because I called a robot in a fictional game simp? Oh. Well, see how that goes. <laughs> Hey, isn't that the B-double robot from Gondo's place? Just a second. Is that? It is! That's the windmill propeller. That thing was supposed to have fallen below the clouds. Are you saying that whole story handed down through Gondo's family was actually true? Hmm. Somehow I get the feeling this is on some elaborate prank, but I guess I'll try to fix this thing. This goes in here, and it's just crank that a few clicks. Phew! That ought to do it. If you can find some way to spin the propeller, you can probably turn the windmill around. Honey! Honey? Oh no, I think I might have promised my wife I fixed her cupboard. I swear that woman's always looking for somebody. See you around, Link! I can see what's happening, and they don't have a clue. It's the bottom line, our trio's down to two. Boom. shaka laka laka boom boom Now we climb the freaking tower. Um. Hey buddy. Hey there, Link. Thanks again for the stamina potion. Since you gave it to me, I've been doing push-ups like a machine. You'll see I'll be as tough as you in no time. Glad to hear it, buddy. Now die. I'm so worried. Oh yeah, she went to the colorful islands. I'll go look for her in a bit there. One of the more infuriating minigames. Who the fuck could that be? Give me a sec, guys. Hello. We're still in the house. There's your thing, house. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, well. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I 
Yeah, Bobo left. <clears throat> let's sound let's sound the goddess song beneath the light radiant on upon her chosen hero shall fall piercing ray of guidance. Nothing's wrong with apples. That is such excellent sound quality. <laughs> well, never mind. <sighs> we'll just have to deal with the terrible sound quality. Forever and ever. Till I buy a new capture card. That has fixed that shit. Master, there is a high probability that this beam of light will lead us to clues as to whereabouts of the three flames. I recommend that you investigate what lies at the end of this beam of light. How very nice of you to suggest something, Fee. Okay, let's go to the colorful island over there. Flat on my face. Uh, oh, what am I going to do? It's no use, it's all over. What's wrong? You see, the party wheel that I pinned to my back flew off the island and fell down somewhere below the clouds. Without my party wheel, there's just no way I can make this island a fun place where people come to have fun. What can I do? It fell. Am I supposed to go get something and fall below the clouds? That's impossible. There's an ability can be calibrated to locate the item that this person seeks. However, if you're searching for other objects that someone has asked you to find, the target will be removed. Can you switch to this target? Do you wish to set the party wheel as a dousing target? Yes, please. Understood, Master. We'll calibrate your dousing ability so that you can assign the party wheel to the dousing target. Who have landed in Lanayu Desert? It is, if it fell in this vicinity, I recommend you investigate the desert. It would be so amazing if someone were to find it. Just think of the smiles of children's faces. I'm not getting my hopes up, though. Okay, so you're not the person that I'm looking for. Oh. Close chest. Colorful islands around here, so. Let's 
to a similar island. What the frick is this? Looks like something I could blow up. Maybe I can crash into it with triangle. I mean, X, Y, button it is. Well, no. I'm sorry, bird friends. Nothing here either. Where, where could the girl be? Oh, here. Hi. Well, if it isn't Link, I'm so glad you're here. My bird got injured while I was out for a quick flight. And now I can't fly. I somehow managed to make a crash landing here, but now we can't get home. I can't go home until my bird's better. I need medicine to get him healthy. It can't be human medicine, it has to be bird medicine. Hey Link, I really need your help. Will you go get some bird medicine for me? Of course. <laughs> You're a lifesaver. My older brother has some bird medicine. Just go find him and I'll give you something. I bet he's probably pacing around the plaza on Skyla waiting for me to come home. Lee, you already spoke to him? Well, that makes things easier. Be waiting for you. Hurry back! You really gotta hurry? Lady, lady, listen. I don't wanna hurry. I wanna, I wanna be slow. Hey, buddy, I found your sister. Found my sister? Bird's injured and can't fly. It's terrible. In that case, take her this. Take this to her as quickly as you can. These are mushroom spores. They will heal the bird's injury. Now, my poor bird should be healthy again in no time. <laughs> I was beginning to think we were doomed. You saved my life and my birds. We both owe you big thanks. That's Gucci. I'm gonna get all 80 at some point anyways, but...
flies like a maniac. She's a maniac. Maniac. Through the dough. Oh. Do, 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 do. All the storms. Look at these nasty buggers. I'm not sure if this was an actual dungeon or just an island. Yeah. Master Link, I have memories of this island. It is known as the Isle of Songs. Signs indicate that it was left here for you by the Goddess Master. However, I'm unable to determine a means of entering the structure ahead. I suggest you investigate the area. Hmm. Oh ho ho! Oh ho ho! Rotate the center pedestal to complete the bridge that allow you to step into the Great Tower of the Isle of Songs. Oh. Yeah, I'm starting to figure it out again. one uh, but I need to keep pushing the other ones otherwise it's not gonna to get them in a row first. Hmm. Give me a sec. I can only push it forward. Oh, that's bad. It's fine. Um, 
upwards. One, two. Okay, now there aren't any more blocks in the way if I change it to this one. And then we can push it to the middle. Jordan needed to test his intelligence again. Jordi is not good at testing his intelligence. After all, his intelligence is only only minuscule. That's not creepy at all. A singing statue. Master Link, I have important information. When you struck the crest with the Skyward Strike from your sword, a message from the goddess awakened within my memory. The goddess intended this message for you, Master. These are her words. He who seeks the sacred flames, listen well, for I guide you from my place at the edge of time. The sacred flames are three in number. To obtain them, you must also earn relics known as the three sacred gifts. For each trial you overcome, you shall be blessed with one of the gifts. Make use of the power of these gifts, and you will find your way to the purifying flame, sacred flames. Now I bestow to you a melody. It will serve you as a key, opening the first trial that awaits you deep in the wilds of Farron Woods. That song is called Farrar's Courage. Its rousing melody will guide you. You learn Farore's Courage. Fadulda. Master, you must overcome the trial set before you and obtain the three gifts to reach the sacred flames. Commit Farore's Courage to memory. Now you can use your dowsing ability to search for the gates leading to the first trial you must face. I suggest we set out to Farrar Race Woods. I don't really need to do that, actually. I know exactly where it is. Mwahaha. <laughs> Still raining outside. It's raining, yeah. Hallelujah, it's raining, Ah, die, scumbag. No, oh, go away, tornados. Tornados, lados.
How dare you make a fool of me? Get the rupee sad face. Uh, this is where the dungeon is. This is where everyone is. Or so starting at in the woods, because there are a few things that I can open now with that I have some bams. And of course, bugs to find. Easy. Are the goldy ones here? So many golden ones. Of heart. A piece of heart. Ooh. Got a grass old bomb. Also spawn stronger enemies. Dang it, birds. I'm trying to capture the... Medication alarm. Yaddy yaddy. Well, that can be helped. Oosh. Medication. 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 Medication.
Ой, лош. Stay. Dang it. Ha ha! That's nice. Okay, so there are birds. Wonder if I can shoot at them with the slingshot. No. Okay, so I really need to use the bug net. Got a bird feather. Well, that's an annoying thing to get. I need quite a few of them as well. Yeesh. Well, it's a problem for later. for more bugs. Ooh, there. A ladybug. A ladybug. It's just a beetle. It's still something that I need. Stupid moblin. Stupid the goblin. Moblin the boblin. Well. <laughs> oh, let's blow up this wall. Oh 
<laughs> chest. Sardolf! I... In our blue bird feather. Yari yari da ze. Link, he come to town, come to save the Princess Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, yeah, that's legit what he does. Murder things on his path to save Princess Zelda. What else do you have to know? Mm, I say Mario. That's first. <laughs> Truth cannot be denied. But Mario is Jumpman, and Link cuts people up with a sword. With a mighty sword. Let's try again, grabbing another burp. Ah, frick! Mario glides by wearing a raccoon costume. It's way out of his league. <laughs> uh... Blink can do that too. With a cape and other things. Also, Link can shoot him out of the air with super skilled archery. No, damn it! <sighs> yes, I'm trying to catch birds in a bug net. What are you mumbling about? Okay, Zidlar, tell us who's better, Link or Mario? You know what? I'll just hold it low and then swing it. See if that works. Neither. Nothing, just accepting the Mario supremacy. There is no Mario Supremacy. There is only Link. Damn! Got another one. None of them have a monkey tail. <laughs> Um, so, uh, Ziller is part of the Saiyan Supremacy, eh? Oh, double! No? Oh. Zidane. 
That is Final Fantasy and not... Oh, crap. And not Nintendo. And on PlayStation, not on Nintendo. Damn. Yeah, Zillar, come on, man. And we were talking about Nintendo. So, like, ju just like Peach, Zelda gets captured daily. Yeah. Except it's getting a lot more evil than Bowser. Hey, Sep! With the resub 38 months? Jesus fucking Christ, man. Yeah, are you having fun, brah? Who's it? Wait, who's in Super Smash? Ah, fuck! Missed it again. Cloud. But Cloud is Cloud. I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to say to get to that. I am um, being alive. How are you, Sep? Staying alive, staying alive. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Uh, stay alive. Samus. Okay, Samus is a girl. And a badass. So she beats Link and Mario. I agree. Glad to hear you're okay, Sep. Glad to hear you're okay. I am trying to catch Liburbs. Hey, Emma is playing Super Smash Bros. Ha ha ha! Got another burp fetter. Yeah, my book catching skills are over nine thousand, boy. Only that was actually true. I wouldn't have failed catching my beetle here, but sure. Bitch! Can I even catch that one? Oh, he's all the way up there. I don't think so. <laughs> well, not if I fall down. This Janus what he did to Moon to turn into a Ivan iconic meme face in Mask of Majula. Nani? What the freak you're saying, bruh? My puny brain can't comprehend. See if I can catch this beetle on the tree. If he's back. Bitch. 
been playing Tales of Arise today in Genshin. You having fun with both of them, Zilla. Zilla boy. No beetles, sad face. Mwahaha! <laughs> Butterflies! <laughs> I am Blink the Butterfly Hunter. Well, I got Jean, so yes. And you got your uh, C1 uh, a ball, right, as well. Oh. And Majora's Mask. Why the moon looks like like a someone farts on it. <laughs> because uh, it was supposed to look scary. Now don't look at the 3DS version, because that one is definitely uh, next level. Something here is reacting to a performance on Furore's Courage. I've confirmed the appearance of a strange mark on the ground. Yeah, me too. I calculate a 99%, 90% chance that this mark is a trial gate, as mentioned by the goddess statue we heard from on the Isle of Songs. Trust your sword in the center of the mark on the ground before you. Yes, guys, I need to trust my sword. Oh. Into the ground. Welcome to the scariest shit of this game, the Silent Realm. <sighs> Master Link, as expected, I cannot follow you into this realm, for this trial calls out to your mind alone. This is the nature of places known as Silent Realms. They are doma domains of the spirit accessible only to the goddess chosen hero. This particular trial, Furore's Silent Realm, tests the limit of your courage. Your spirit is temporarily separated from your physical body so that you may undertake this challenge. To reach the location of the flames that will enhance your sword, it is necessary for you to overcome this trial and undergo spiritual growth. You've got a spirit vessel! So, in Zelda Universe, the moon has a face, naturally. No, only in um, Termina, which is a, technically a different realm from Hyrule. Vessel's full, it will signify you have successfully completed the trail, allowing to your spirit to grow. This, in turn, will allow the goddess to bless you with a new power. To fill the spirit vessel, you need to search for something known as Tears of Ferrari. There are many of them spread across this strange world. Master, do you see the glowing object just in front of you? That is the Tear of Aurora. You will need to collect 15 of them. However, this is not as simple a task as it would seem. Your work in this realm is referred to as a trial for a good reason. If you take even a single step outside the protective circle you can stand in, the guardians of this realm will wake up and pursue you, master. If a guardian manages to land even a single hit on you, your spirit will shatter and you will fail the trial. Is Ruby still the main currencies? Rupees. Rupees. Yeah. Once you collect the tears scattered throughout this area, you and fill the spirit vessel without being hit by an attack. Was my explanation clear, Master? Got it. Understood, Master. I will eagerly await your return into this world. May the goddess watch over you. Oh shit.
I can walk back in there, so that's good. Tears for 30 seconds, that's not too bad actually. I have 90 seconds in total, every single one that I pick up gives me 30 for free. This one completely fills it. Seriously, the Silent Realm is one of the worst areas in this entire freaking game. If I stand in that water, by the way, I also get instantly triggered on everyone. Master Link. <laughs> These unusual liquid, su liquid substances that cover that area is known as waking water and its certain unique properties. If you make contact with the waking water, the guardians will immediately alert it to your presence. Pools of waking water are located all throughout the area. I suggest you watch where you step. How very nice of you, uh, Fee, to tell me about this. You got a dusk relic. Oh, I was wondering when I was gonna find those. Okay, gotta watch out for the ghosts, because they alert the Guardians as well. <laughs> Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down my spine. Ah, come on, Link! Oh, I don't have to climb up, actually. We're not gonna jump down into the water, that's a dumb idea. We're jumping to the side of the water, we're grabbing the dusk thingy. We're sprinting through here, grab that. You look kinda scary, not gonna lie. Grab this one. Way back. Is the first one is not so hard. This is still probably one of my least favorite shit to do in this game. The silent room. Grab as many of these as you can possibly get your paws on, Yordi. Clever game. Spirit has grown. The trouble will continue until you exit the silent road. Proceed with caution on your way back to the entrance. Oh shit! What the frick? Um. I want that. Give me. How did I roll into? Ah, like that. Oh, oops. Um. Oh. 
<laughs> sort of. Yeah. If you step in that uh, water, they all the guardians will proc and want to murder your ass. So yeah. You got the Water Dragon Scale, this sacred gift left by the goddess grants you the power to explore underwater and even ex execute a spin maneuver. Jesus. You can't, I don't have swords. I'm armless. It's only now that I get my sword back. Congratulations, Master Link. You have passed this trial. You now have the power to proceed to the location of the first sacred flame that will enhance your sword. The Water Dragon skill is one of the goddess' sacred gifts. The great spirit of the Water Dragon has provided you with the ability to swim freely underwater. The flame you seek is somewhere within these woods, Master. I must conclude that this flame is likely in a part of this area you have not explored yet. How very smart of you, Fi. Ah, hello again. I see you have the Water Dragon scale there, Q. That's amazing. I heard that if you have one, Q, you can swim through water like a dragon soars through the sky. There must be a place here in the woods that you haven't visited yet. You should use the dragon scale to explore areas you couldn't even get in before, Q. Oh. Well, oh, hey, big boy. Are you dead yet? Good. Because that's what I like to see. Dead enemies, not living ones. I want that Kabuto thingy. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I got him. Woodland Rhino Beetle. I miss one more bug for my complete collection. Fine additions to my collection. Sardolf no Sardolf. Ah, I got one at least. Okay, now. Okay, so that's the spin.
Well, this place doesn't look very nice. Inside the great tree. Extreme. Once? Yes, I haven't completed this game before, though. No, no, Link is not an elf. Link is an Hylian. But yeah, technically he's an elf. Here we go again. Got another one. There's no flute in this game. Sads. Ow. Currently, we only have the harp. Fuckers are alive as well again. <laughs> Jordy. Get a grip, will ya?
I need to shave again. My face is itchy. If it's one thing Yordi doesn't like, it's an itchy face. Ah, fuck, I walked too fast. Leap, thanks. He went away. That's your Italian gangster name. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that's not my Italian gangster name. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. Domo arigato, Mr. Roboto. treasure. Die. No! Okay, at least I landed on where the treasure was. <sighs> at least that was fine. Ooh, full 300 bigger rooms. Nice. So there was something up here. Well, that's good to know. Or if I ever decide to replay this game again. Again, the big fuck just pushed me off. What an asshole. Well, at least the chest wasn't completely garbage. Seeing as I need a shit ton of money in this game.
hate slingshots in this game. It's absolute garbage. What is that heavy breathing that I keep hearing? This motherfucker is still dead. Aha! We now have a flight point. In case I do drop down. No cheaters! Okay. Goodbye. Monster thing. But oh, this seems like fun. <laughs> Not. Ooh. Grab money, flying beetle. Okay, good job. You have reached the top of the tree. From this vantage point, you have a good view of the woods. Perhaps you will see an area you haven't explored. Perhaps. Oh, that guy. Master, look up there. Confirmed the discovery of a new PQE. Analysis indicates 90% chance that the sounds we were hearing were loud snores of this Kiwi. Should I sh- <laughs> uh, Well. That means only one thing. Chikui! <laughs> Sad that they didn't fall off the tree. Who's it? I'm napping. Oh, look at that. Real life human. Haven't seen one of you in a while. <laughs> I don't know why I give this accent to this old fucker here. They used to call me Yerbal. Now I'm just the old Kikui hermit. I watch over this forest here when I'm not napping. Don't know how you wandered all the way up here, but let me ask you something. Can you really see me? Sure can. Is that so? Well then, slap yourself on the back, Quirk. You know, some Kiwis can't even see me these days. But forget all of that nonsense and tell me, what business does a real-life human have in these forests? The flame. You're out questing for flame to enhance your sword, so that you can find someone important to you, eh? How about that? A human who can see me and seeks a great flame. Listen, do you promise not to breathe a word of what I'm about to tell you to another soul? I promise. Alright, I'll tell you, but remember, it's a secret to everybody. HA! Easter egg. The flame that you seek is the most most likely Ferrora's flame. Yes, yes, Ferrora's flame. That story begins very long ago when the goddess was still with us. The goddess gave the flame to the water dragon, a great spirit that presides... Persites over Fern Woods. The way I hear it is she's left the flame in the care of the water dragon so that one day the mighty dragon could pass it on to the one from the sky. You see, I've got a hunch that the goddess was talking about you, lad. Well, that settles that you must seek out the mighty water dragon. Her lair is deep in the lake in the south of the woods, sir. She watched show the flame there. There's a problem, though. The gate that leads to that lake is sealed shut to all those judged unworthy. But don't worry. I'll let you in on a trick to opening the gate. To open a gate, you have to channel 
of the power of the goddess into the symbol carved into the door. Oh, but it isn't so simple. The symbol is incomplete, so to unlock the gate, you must make the symbol whole. The only way you'll know what the complete symbol should be like is to first find that same completed symbol somewhere else in these woods. The gate is down in the south, so likely there's a matching symbol somewhere up north. Try searching near there. Okay. It's all of seeping... Is all this seeping into your head, lad? Do you know where to? you must go to find symbol you seek? Got it. Then I wish you safe travels, lad. Oh, wait up. Are you gonna give me something? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give I forgot to mention this earlier, but it's important. Here, Her Excellence the Water Dragon is very... Persnickety about manners, so watch yours. I've heard stories of folk who caught her in a fuzzy mood. They ended up as mid-morning snacks. I probably taste like old cave moss, but I'm not in the mood, <laughs> not in the hurry to become a royal meal. So don't let her know I told you about the feral flame, okay? And remember, when you're in her hall, you better be on your best behavior and be a gracious guest. I'll be here napping if you need some of my elder elder wisdom. See you around. See you around. So this is not pointed north. Wait, is that another? No. This, on the other hand, is pointed north. Ow. I pressed the wrong button, sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Damn it. Ah! Dang it, he flew off. That one's still here? Yeah. Okay, slowly, Yordi. Damn it! Damn it! Yordi, you suck! Well, that's easy. I need to some do something specific, no? How do I get there? Hmm. Guess I just need to jump down from top. Let me go do grab that real quick. Fly back up. To the sky! I don't want to climb that stupid tree again. Wee. Kind of drop off a uh fly off far when you get back into the sky. The great tree viewing platform. The great tree. Yes. Yes! No! Yeah, yeah, yo! Hearing the old guy snore again is annoying. Free stuff. Okay. So I need to jump. There. 
Wait. One. Haha, <laughs> I did it! Good jump, you already good jump. Now don't fall down. another box complete it I don't remember what second phase dungeon gives me the hook shot actually I know that the second phase dungeon in the desert gives me what is it called again the bow such a hard name to remember right you already That almost went wrong. Book, 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 book. Hey, Hiko. How are you doing, buddy? Cheek is still swollen. Looks like I've been stung by a bee. Wait, but did you actually get stung by a bee? Oh, damn, son. When did that happen? Eh. Ah, sir, my calculations indicate there's a probability of lies beyond the gate. I also have deduced that the power of the goddess the Kikui Hermit referred to is in fact the Skyward Strike. Charge your sword while standing in front of the gate and use its energy to draw a symbol. Okay. That failed. <laughs> Try again. Tuesday, I was spitting blood like a mother trucker. Damn, son. Is that good enough? Yeah. Yeah, I can uh, understand that, actually. Wisdom teeth removal is not a pretty thing. Aleandro! Look at that dive. Elegant and fierce. Lake Floria. Calm down around Saturday or Sunday. Uh, I can understand that you hope that. <laughs> I hope so for you as well, my dude. Let's see if there's anything fun over there. But I'm. Um... Oh, crap. But I'm guessing that's a no-no. Ah! 
Another human! Okay, okay. I just have to avoid eye contact and back away slowly. talk to this guy. Ha! Ah, human in the water. Look at him trying to flap around in the water. Wow. <laughs> Bro, that's racist! Quit following me past. If you don't move long, I'll be forced to tell Her Excellency the Water Dragon about your little intrusion. Well, I'm actually here to talk to Her Excellency the Water Dragon. Ha! Didn't see that coming, did you? Yep, there's no way you're going to be able to follow me through here. So now, what now? You're going to cry? If you think you can make it through, just go ahead and try. Ah! How is it even possible? I've never seen a human pull off a spin like that. Wait. That's the Water Dragon skill. Does that make you the emissary of the goddess, like the water dragon said? Hey, I've got an idea. Maybe you can help her excellency. What's wrong? Yeah, about that. It happened really recently. This weirdo came in here with a gang of monsters and went right after her excellency. My lady, the water dragon, is a fierce fighter, and boy, did she gobble up most of the monsters in the first few seconds. Thing is, there were just so many of them. While she was distracted, the weirdo leading all those creatures managed to wound her. She's healing up now, but she says we don't have enough special water for her to make full recovery. So could you please go talk with Her Excellency and see if you can help her out? I'll even take you to her. Follow me. He's still backing away slowly, though. <laughs> It's such a nice looking place though, not gonna lie. Yeah, that's weird, I was expecting to meet up with a friend here. Path is blocking with a huge boulder. Lovely, now what do we do? Um, spin these motherfuckers right into them. Well, at least you have some time to chill, right? That's not too bad. Oh, oops. Keep, don't eat me. I don't need you. What? You don't want to gobble me up? Oh, that's a relief. Hiding here for a while, you know, first since the school of scary looking fish swarm through. Mm, that looks like a pathway. It's not what I want to do yet. Oh, now that's using your noodle. Her excellence is just up ahead. Yeah, I don't care. I'm trying to break open everything. This hole. Silver Rupee. Okay, that's everything. Ah, frick. Come on, hurry up. Now you can't go through. She's you can send your bones. Talk about inconvenience. I guess you can leap over the top 
the wall if you have to. Almost did it first try. Perfect jump. Oh, you amazing, but I think we both know it was the Water Dragon skill that made that little stunt possible. How? What a prick is this guy? So rude. Oh. Come on, game. Don't be assholey and give that thing to me. Okay, so he can go through there, I guess, but I can go through there. Need to jump again. Get it, I get it. Scheiße! Where do you suck? <laughs> what do you say? What do you mean? I don't suck. Yes, you do. Okay, that was a good enough jump, I guess. Good enough! At least those aren't electrical slimes. Because Lizzie's gonna laugh at me again because I keep getting myself electrocuted. Ooh, the goddess plume. Music here is quite serene. Kill the slime! Oh, there's another goddess spoon there. Get a hum, get a hum. Okay. And back down. Oh. Um, I'm pressing the wrong button. I need to eat better, but I like non healthy food, just like me. I feel you, I feel you. Killed it. The fuck is this thing? Yikes, so oh, they're back. That's one of the fish that Weirdo brought in here. Used to attack Her Excellency. Especially when you're lazy with your foos. <laughs> yeah, true. Watch out, they're mean. They're as mean as they come. Did I fight this motherfucker again? Hmm, like that. Whoa, the goddess sure knows how to pick them. You did great. Thanks, bra. Is 
As long as you remember, I was born this way. What's this? Okay, not that interesting. At last, we are here. I'm too scared to weigh myself. Weigh yourself? Oh, you mean, like, uh, to see how much you weigh in, like, yeah, <laughs> I was like, money, weigh yourself, and then, oh, wait, this makes sense. Please come in. Oh, this is uh, quite the impressive place you got here, boys. But I see goodies, and when Jordi sees goodies, that means Jordi needs to go grab the goodies before doing anything else of importance. He's not very good at this, swimming with motion controls. Ah, you there, human. You have intruded into my home, a sacred place few are permitted to enter. This is no place for one such as you. And yet here you stand. Will you explain how you <clears throat> how you got here and quickly? I am. Those good manners address me as Farum, Warden of the Woods. I was appointed by the goddess herself, but my current state is less than, well, intimidating, shall we say? Know that you stand in the presence of a loyal servant of the goddess. Yeah, true, that's definitely true. Take your time, Hiko. I say, that's one of my skills you have there. A sacred gift such as that could only be carried by the goddess chosen hero. But could you really be him? This raises questions, even with that skill in your possession. Finding my hall is no easy task. How did you find me? Ah, yes. That crackling old hermit Kikui told you where I lived, didn't he? Honestly, I can't remember how many times I told him that I told that scuffy thing to keep his mouth shut. That's the last straw. Next time I see him, he's dinner. Oh, but I digress. You've come here seeking a sacred flame, have you? Of course. I knew it. But I'll be straight with you. A shrimpy boy like you hardly looks the part of the goddess chosen hero. There's no doubt about it. Attest this in order to prove you're everything you say you are. Shortly before your arrival, I was attacked by a pompous creature calling himself Girahim. I stood against his self-proclaimed demon, self demon lords, but I was wounded in the encounter. The wounds he's given me are stubborn things. I have been forced to recuperate in the basin of sacred water. Unfortunately, the healing properties of sacred water have diminished, and I am now in need of another dose to freshen up my healing bath. Bring me the container of fresh sacred water that I require. Do me this favor and I'll gladly show you where to find the sacred flame. You say, you got it. I'm analyzing the water remaining in this basin. Excellent. I can now help you douse for water types you are searching for. The water type you are searching for. Master, you have wisely elected to carry an empty bottle. Use it to carry the water you seek. If you continue down this way, you will find an exit back to the woods. Excellent. Now run along. One does not keep a dragon waiting. Uh, listen, dragons keep me waiting. 
so I kindly respawn the same way. Chests! Oh man. A monster horn. Ooh, there's another chest on the other side as well. Silver rupee. You thought you had answer. See where this leads me. Sheik stone, ba boing. Thanks, buddy. I can't actually go through there yet, because that's where the flame is at. Link, why do you suck? Ooh. Ha ha ha! Oh. Got him. I don't need the butterflies. Master, I have information to report. By my estimate, you are currently situated in the southwest area of Fire Woods. Please confirm your location with the map. Here am I. Let's see, I'm here. Two water spots. Should try to grab that one. Well, too late now. 
Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, hi, stinkies. None of me to deal with these stink heads. These stinky winkies. Further down we go. Aha, all the bees. Come on, beetles. Way too high up. Annoying. Didn't have a horn at Larve yet. Okay. So let's see. More goodies for Yordi to pick up. Ow. A baboing. Okay, a little Not even to deal with that mofo. Could I really have to go back into the dungeon? That is kind of interesting. My readings indicate the presence of sacred water within the temple. Unfortunately, it's not possible to use your dowsing build here. So my calculation, the estimate the water is located in the deepest part of the dungeon complex. Yeah.
At least they seem to have improved on the dungeon's enemies. Slightly. Ooh. What's this? Hold it! You're the guy! The guy I met in the volcano! Here to do some treasure hunting? Yep. I called it! You got treasure hunter written all over your face! Let the big stone guy out there tip you off to the loot too, stone guy? No one's beating me to all the sweet loot piled up in this place. Wait, seriously? The place is locked up again. That gotta be a joke, right? I legit don't remember this at all. That is actually kind of surprising, mate. Just fantastic. I worked like a weasel to just swipe key from that monster, then I have to go and lose it. Just can't remember which hole I dig it in. Ah, uh, and here I thought that key would be my trick ticket to life of luxury. Sworn I buried it right around here. Welcome back, you go.
Well, how do I get back there? Do I need to... Wait, can I lower the water again? Maybe. No, can't. It's that face. Could have sworn I dug it around here somewhere. anywhere. It's the darnest thing. I buried a key around here, but I can't recall where it exactly put it. Oh, where could I have hidden that key? I guess I might not be in be this room after all. You don't happen to be on your map, do you, pal? I don't know your map. Here. Hmm. Nothing here. Fucking spider. Where in the ever-loving fuck is this key? Okay. 
This is not amusing whatsoever. Okay, it must be in this room. It must blow up the wall or something, because... I know what else. Because I don't think I can, like, just swim... Are you kidding? I can just swim through it? Oh, that's bullshit. Runs through the entire dungeon. Probably figured out where it was initially, but... Denied it because he thought he couldn't swim through the gap. Such a typical Yordi thing. So typical, Yordi. Thinking he too big brain. Not cool, mate. You guys are not gonna trigger, so... Oh, I see it already. Mine's... works. Take some serious miles to get my paws on treasure and I've got squat. Talk about bad luck. I think some no good thief beat me to goods. There's nothing here but water now. Even a stinking world would come all this way for water. Nobody, that's who. I'm cutting my losses and I'm heading home. See ya. Did you just call me a loser? So called me a loser. I feel offended. It's a kind of magic, magic, magic. Back to where we first fought here, him. Ow.
Sorry, bro. Can't say I'm a willing participant. didn't say you had a choice. You said willing participants, so that means that I must be willing to join. AKA, I had a, have a choice. You got sacred. I've heard most people do everything at soft air points. Have a nerf gun. I'm not afraid to use. Listen, I've been shot by a soft air gun multiple times on close range. I am not scared of taking hits for close range soft air gun. It's not that big a deal. Ow. What would I need that bomb for anyways? Is there anything funky around here? Doesn't look like it. <laughs> Any who's is what? It's not that bad to get shot by a soft gun, soft air gun. shot in general. Daylight come in the cold bubble bowl. Don't 
don't mind me. I'm just being weird again. You don't just shoot me in the dick. But you said shoot him, but not in the dick. Something like that. <clears throat> As if I have a well enough memory to remember fucking South Park scenes. I just watched that episode. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Not cool, butters. <laughs> You know what my first episode was that I watched of uh, South Park was where all of them turned into zombies. That was the first South Park episode I watched. And after that, I was too scared to ever watch South Park again until I was well way older. Look at that color. There's no doubt this water uh, that I need. I watched it when I was 12, 14, because of my sister. Yeah, my first episode, I was uh, six ish. I don't recommend it. Exquisite, I can feel its energy surging through me. Behold, full majesty of Farum, water dragon and guardian of these lands, a centaur healed and whole once again. You and you have done well to bring me to the sacred water I asked you for. I see now it was no coin coincidence that you complete the goddess trial and obtain the water dragon scale. In turn, I will grant you the favor you have asked of me and lead you to the sacred flame of my land. Come. Now behold. Go, the sacred flame you seek lies within this place. While the waterfall has barred the entrance to this place for many years, monsters have still found a way in. In science, they flourish. Ah, but you are the goddess chosen hero. Swatting a few monsters will be no trouble for you. Imagine you and I will cross paths again. Until then, do not lower your guard. Farewell, boy. Boy! Damn, it took me three hours to get to the second entr or the second entrance to the new dungeon. I want to bother for the rest of the night. I'm honestly been super exhausted today. Mentally, physically, oh, it's this dungeon. <sighs> oh. 
I'll be honest, I don't think I have the brain energy today to actually do an entire dungeon. Yeah, I think this is a good calling it quits moment. Ugh. Saving, turning the power off. Partially. Oh, guys, gals, ladies and gents, thank you all for having me much for out with me tonight. Oh, uh, I hope I feel better tomorrow so that we can do some Yu-Gi-Oh during the day and maybe continue Skyward Sword during in the evening. Hiko, hope you feel better soon that the swelling is going to go away. Zep, thank you very much for the resub, as always. Anyways, ladies and gents, guys and gals, until the very fucking next time, a good night.